Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Captain Demon, and uh, we are watching Savage Moments in WWE history, I guess. Mm -hmm. Let's go. children right in the eye and say kids your dad's just been arrested i've got a few good matches left in this body and i'll be damned if i'm gonna waste one on a washed up piece of crap like you you don't wear the pants in the family but you do wear her panties don't you i've stayed retired out of respect or is it fear as they go king yeah that's great it feels weird. I like that. Son, the only thing you've been ordering is a whole bunch of damn cheeseburgers. It feels cheap, but then again, we are here in Brooklyn. <laughs> Anybody knows damn. anything about screwing? It's you, Michael. A champion that doesn't talk. Who are you, Brock Lesnar? Hey, hey. What? Are you still here? <laughs> yeah, I'm still here. Unlike your money in the bank contract. Even a 747 looks small when you're flying it into the Grand Canyon. What in the world? Seth Rollins versus Dean Ambrose. Do you have to ask permission from your father-in-law first? <laughs> yes, he does! Yes, he does! Yes, he does! I love my wife and children, and that is never, ever going to happen. You're screwed way worse than Bret Hart was ever screwed. I'm gonna take care of that smelly, greasy, nasty animal. And I'm gonna get you too, Rhino. You've got a man beast and a hose beast. Ever see the WCW title again? Is that the sorry line? Uh -oh. You wanna walk with Elias. But I have to break it to you, Trish. I don't date women in their 60s. <laughs> Nothing that this man hasn't done in this business except beat me. Damn. Tonight, you will force me to strip you of the WWF Championship. When I get backstage, I am going to beat the living shit out of you. And that's the bottom line. If you were in the ECW, you'd be showing that spirit. I can hear it now. If this was ECW, I wouldn't be working with a hack like you. The only reason you are WWE Champion for a year is because Triple H didn't want to work Tuesday! It's not where would WWE be without John Cena, it's where would John Cena be without WWE! The biggest thing to hit Canada because the Maple Leafs suck! See live prostitution on Monday Night Raw! I was talking to you, Mick Foley! You came out and wanted to hit me with a chair. Oh, you're laughing now, boy, but you won't in a minute. You got a date with the dead man. You gonna punch me in the face? Or do you gotta go ask your wife permission first? What are you, Mr. Canada? <laughs> So condescending to the champ and get out of my ring. Careful you don't hurt your neck again going through those ropes. I bashed the old man and his son in the skull. I RKO'd and DDT'd Stephanie. Maybe I attend a McMahon family outing. I haven't seen Linda in a while. 
to Piper's Pit. Oh, thank you very much for having me, you little son of a bitch. We all know that Brad Maddox is your puppet. He works for you, son of a bitch husband. He cares very deeply about Linda McMahon. Loving, mature women. Oh boy. I said the other day, big breasted, mature women like your mom. Oh my gosh. Find something, I lost something. I went in the back looking through my bag and uh, I found a can of whoop ass and it had Hulk Hogan's name on it. After all, you're the one sleeping with him. Friday before you step into that ring that you retrieve your balls from Stephanie's purse. This is why no one likes coming to New York. You need to watch your mouth, rich boy. Your legacy died. From the very day that you were born, you've been your daddy's I'm gonna take my respect. I bounce you quicker than an ECW check. I have one last opportunity. Beating, okay? I would, but uh, I know where that hand's been. Fine, I blame you. I'm still here because you can't do your job. I'd rather okay. listen to a recording of JR than a live Michael Cole. Maybe having a bottle of champagne around you isn't the best idea. Oh. Must have been a special treat for you, considering at the time you probably weren't coherent enough to remember any of it anyways. You know, of all people, you know, I know the whole damn world knows that big son of a bitch never busted me open. Listen to that. How was your movie, by the way? Oh, I missed it. I, mine, mine went straight to DVD, just like yours. <laughs> the Roman Empire will fall. Hook the streak away from the Undertaker. Mm. This one you'll cheer when my client Brock Lesnar took John Cena to Suplex City. John Bradshaw Layfield and those two other things that call themselves announcers stood up, Superdome Hogan, not Silverdome, and gave... Um, my tag team division is full. Uh -oh. I hear the TNA is higher. Yeah, I heard that sounds fucking low. Yeah, it only takes is one that, RKO that to get to Viperville. No enhancement needed. <laughs> he can't fire me. Can't fire me. <laughs> <laughs> he will buy that piss ant company just to fire you again. You actually think you deserve a shot at this? You don't deserve This coming from a man? Who took a sacred vow of marriage to the biggest slut in the Like I'm watching one of my movies because this whole damn thing sucks. <laughs> Made you a promise. Daddy was coming home. It looks like he's not. But I'll be your new daddy. <laughs> Let's talk about your kids. That's I don't give a kids. Wow. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. That's good as crap. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't scare me, but it's kind of funny, fucking hilarious. Seeing people. <laughs> well, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.